Hi guys, I'm Justin Z. I am an independent filmmaker in Los Angeles and I'm a freelance editor for the entertainment industry. I've been getting some basic questions about filmmaking, including this one. What films are good for narrative storytelling? Well, most films are good for narrative storytelling. Most good films, most memorable films are good for narrative storytelling. And basically what that means is that it's a movie that you can follow visually, just visually, without any audio. Try it sometime. Watch, watch one of your favorite movies uh, without any audio and see if you can follow it. Or try that with a brand new movie. Some examples of some of my favorite films um, are, first of all, old school black and white films. Back when they had very little sound or no sound at all, they literally had to tell the story visually. So one of my favorites is Citizen Kane. That's a really good one. Uh, a lot of foreign films are very good at doing that too, such as Man Bites Dog. Check that film out sometime. Amazing film. Very visually driven. Another great film which follows the visual medium is Night of the Living Dead. Very, very visually driven. Shows shots of people going from place to place with very little dialogue to propel them. A not so good uh, narratively driven film is one that uses too much dialogue or audio to uh, explain to the audience what's going on. Now that doesn't necessarily make a bad film, it's just not the type of visual narrative that you want to watch. A great example of a director who makes almost purely visual films that is modern is Steven Spielberg. Watch E.T., Jurassic Park, Close Encounters of the Third Kind. They're almost entirely visual. You can get through those movies with almost no dialogue at all. It's really quite amazing. So that's basically all there is to it with visual narrative movies. If you have any questions about this or anything else, feel free to ask.